Hi everyone, I've got an Aldi haul. We needed to get some things there because they're a lot cheaper. And uh, I've got a little Dollar Tree haul that we did yesterday and it, it wasn't, an, it's not enough to do like a whole, you know, a video. So I thought I'd go ahead and show it with this. I don't have too many videos today that way. I got these butterflies. I thought they were really nice looking. They kind of got a lot of reflection. You can see them, I hope. Got those. I really like those. So we got this Bugable Centronella wristband. She does, the uh, mosquitoes seem to like her. I guess that's what it's for. Yeah. And they had some little cute... Uh, I just got a couple different ones because I got so many of them with the bobbleheads. Uh, this one is, or oh, looks like a raccoon. Let's see the, that one's cute. And this one is the pink flamingo. I'll bet uh, Martha. I'll bet you would like this. I hear you like. The pink flamingos. It's got the leg up. The leg will be moving, see. Look. <laughs> so we'll have to see if yours has those, Martha. Okay. So we got her some, uh, or a skinchy. Put that with her. Logan really likes this deodorant. They just don't last very long. Uh, Suave Men Active Sport. I'm trying to think if I try if I smelled the other one. Oh yeah. Oh, that smells great, y'all. But for a dollar, I mean, you know, a bigger one, you know, it'd be at least a couple bucks, I'd say. That smells great. No wonder he likes that. And then we got him one of these Power Stick Cool Blast Body Sprays. Let's see what that's like. There's no smell. Hmm. That's pretty good. You'll like that. Those are his. And we got us a few. I don't know how they disappear, but sometimes your utensils seem to disappear. But they got two of them, and they're, they're decent. I mean, two for a dollar. That's what they look like. Got two forks. Let's see. Right there. And two spoons. Same pattern. Right? Well, that's not bad. They're, they're pretty good. They're not flimsy at least. Some of them like that when you buy cheap ones are real flimsy or something. And I saw a new flavor for Logan's reviews. I saw a new flavor of the Harvest Snaps. Everybody seems to be liking those. There's not room, honey. And I got the White Cheddar. They may have had them out, I'm not for sure, but I don't think we've tried this one. White Cheddar. So that'll go... And I got these for me. These things are so good. I just, it's hard for me to stop eating. I mean, I would eat the whole pack. <laughs> I try not to. Now, okay, you can, if you can manage to sit there, you can sit down there. No, don't try to get in the bag, honey. No, come here then. You can't do that. You can't get in the bag. Wait a minute, I'll give you this one. Let's see, she's pulling everything. Now, see? Here. Here. Here's your bag. And then I got these. I don't know if Joy got these for Logan to review or what. I'll just have to see. Magical Marshmallow Twist. Soph Sophie Pops and Gumdrops. I don't know her that, but... Like a unicorn, looks like. 
guess that's supposed to be like. So, and I also got these for his reviews. I like to get as many things as I can that, that are good or, you know, healthy too from Dollar Tree for reviews. That way everybody, most of them have it, you know. Um, I do see stuff at other Dollar Trees that ours don't have lots of time. One of them was a little, uh, I was looking for it. That's one of the reasons we went yesterday uh, while Logan was in therapy. That's what we did. And uh, they had these little things that like stick out in your garden with a little wire, you know, that you stick in the ground. And, but they were uh, gnomes on top. And I wanted some of those, but the girl, actually she wasn't even that friendly. The place was empty. There was one other lady in there, and that's it in the whole store. I'm not kidding. And uh, they were stalking, and I asked her about it. She wasn't very, really very nice. I mean, I, I thought I might strike up a little conversation about it, you know, but she just said, no, I haven't seen them. <laughs> so I said, well, I've seen them on other people's uh, videos on YouTube, and I was hoping that you had them. She said, nope. That's about it. Hadn't seen them. Nope. Anyway, these are sesame chips, honey roasted, though. I thought that was a good one. You gonna get up there on the coffee pot? And we got some snack pack butterscotch pudding. And Joy got two of these Rip It energy drinks. And then, um, I don't eat these really, but, so these are for Logan and Joy Raisinets, two of them. Okay, I think I'll put this stuff up, and I'll start on the Aldi. Hold on. Okay, I'm about half tired. We we mowed the whole yard. I did all the trim. I didn't weed eat, but I used the push mower to get everything that the ride mower wouldn't get and, and went all around my beds out here all the way around the back all the way around the whole front on the outside at the road so I've been pretty busy okay let's see oh got some of these tomatoes on the vine these look pretty good today pretty good got some of their Butter. Got the and these are really good there. They're salad mixes. Uh, this is little salad bar bacon avocado ranch chopped salad kit. And you know a lot of people, not a lot, but I mean some people don't like the cabbage, you know, in them. And I can't eat the harder pieces of cabbage and the bigger ones like there's kind of a big one right there but I can eat uh, some of it uh, you saw I couldn't eat really anything like that but I'm lucky to get to eat some of it I can eat a little we're gonna have burgers um, I don't know if it was tomorrow I know Joy had something planned we have fajitas planned one night and we're gonna have burgers, so we got shredded lettuce. We got their center cut bacon. This is about the best one of the whole, of what they had. It's pretty good, I mean, uh, it's Appleton Farms Gourmet Butcher Sliced Center Cut Bacon. It's 355, so that's really a fair price for center cut. Now it's more expensive over here. One thing, I don't like that they're green peppers, you have to buy three, but $1.79 for three. Um, you know, because that makes me have to use them faster. And I like to buy just one at a time, really, but they don't have it that way. And we got this, we tried this uh, last month, and it was really, really good. I think that's yeah, it was what we used to make the fajitas last time. It's chicken breast strips with rib, rib meat uh, chicken fajitas. You have to lay down, honey. You have to lay down so people can see. She doesn't know that though. And uh, so I thought I would use this, but I don't know if I'm going to use this to make the fajitas or if I'm going to use that mix that we got from Walmart. You can't 
You're gonna have to wait till I get more room on him. Uh, there's a bag. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. These are, I haven't seen these there before, but they're not like, they're like tater tots, but they're like the little tater bucks or whatever they call them, the little, little ones. This says crispy circles. Kitty, wait until I get room, honey. She doesn't know. She wants to put it. Crispy circles. I'll go over some of the prices after I'm done. Uh, I don't like having to look back and forth. I've got these quite a few times. They're really good. The breakfast, the meat lovers. I wish it had more bacon in it, though. And their pie, uh, chocolate cream pie, was only $4.99. Uh, I'm not for sure. I think we've had this one before. And it was fantastic. Really good. This is for one night in the crock pot. Boneless pork shoulder roast with barbecue seasonings. It's really good. I'll probably turn it into barbecue, you know. Uh, pull it, you know, tear it apart and have, probably have barbecue on, you know, buns with it. Got some sour cream. Got, this is my favorite. And what kills me is uh, at Walmart, the Senior Rico, uh, rice pudding at Walmart. I had an Ibotta uh, rebate on them to get them for I don't know how much off now, something like a dollar off. Here, kitty, you like this one? Look, we get in it. And uh, Aldi is actually now on Ibotta, but it doesn't have any of their brand of stuff. It's just regular name brand, and you're you're not gonna hardly find anything that's going to match the rebate there but walmart didn't carry this and they had the rebate but then an aldi carries it and they didn't have the rebate on the aldi uh part of it you know we look up the coupon so i was like crap i thought i was going to get another uh, a rebate from actually from aldi uh their amino cheese is really good i think it's 2.99 i'll have to look i got some of that okay I'm going to put this, all this refrigerated up. Okay, I just got done when I was putting the stuff up in the fridge. I remembered I got these little drinks. They're non-fat probiotic drink. It's, I'm trying to see how to pronounce that. Yakult. Logan said he'd seen commercials on TV about it. Live and active, blah, 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 Lactobillus or whatever. It says no fat, no gluten, no cholesterol. It kind of tasted like a pink starburst. Is what I my best way I could say. But yeah, I tried one of those and they did, and we liked them. We're gonna get more of these. I got I think four cans of these Harvest Happy Harvest basil, garlic, and oregano diced tomatoes. They're only forty six cents. From the bake shop, we got chocolate chip muffins, mini muffins, and these I've talked about before. They're not, what I like about them is they're not very, they're not super sweet. They're a sweet brioche rolls filled with creamy rich chocolate. Uh, it's really not, they don't have as much chocolate as they used to in them. You can see the little places. There's not as much chocolate for some reason. They, they've changed them a little bit to where there's not as much chocolate in there, which I don't like that. I want the same chocolate to be in it as always. This is what we're going to eat. The buns we're going to use for uh, the burgers, the cheeseburgers, when we have them. And they're very, very soft. Um, they, they go through so much stuff over there that everything's always fresh as far as their bakery goods and breads and stuff. I got a couple of German items uh, for Logan's reviews. This one is uh, Deutsch something potato sticks, herbs of the Alp style. I thought that was interesting. 
don't know how good you can read that. But there's another one too. Okay, just move back a little. I got you a place now. And then these peanut puffs, crunchy corn snacks with freshly ground peanuts. I don't know if this is the one we tried before um, that was so good. I'll have to ask Logan, but if we haven't tried them, we'll be trying these also. I've tried other, we've tried other brands and really like them, peanut puffs. And, uh, let's see. Oh, I got two of that one. And then we got some Hawaiian rolls. They were only $1.29. Here's the other one. This one's potato sticks hash brown style wow hash brown I don't know if that one's different imported from Germany so we'll be trying that one too I got these little I wanted to see what these were like because they're only 99 cents little bake shop chocolate, chocolate chunk cookies there's three of them in there, but they look they look good. They're only 99, so that's not bad. And that's the other mayo. Oh, they're still out of the small cans of pinto beans. They just got the huge one, which I don't like. I like this size, so I got the got got the simply nature ones, organic. This is really, really good. It's, well, it's 19 ounces too. There's quite a bit in here. Berman's barbecue sauce, Texas style. This one's really good. They got like Memphis and Texas, and I think they got something, so another flavor. I don't know what it is. Okay, that's the other. And then I got some, trying to, Keep away from so much sugar, so I'm going to start, if this is any good, I'm just going to start getting this one on the applesauce. It's Simply Nature Unsweetened Applesauce. And, let's see here. Oh, we got two of the Belle V 12 Pack Sparkling Waters. You got lemon and lime. They went up just a little bit. They were $2.39. They went to $2.45. The peppers were $1.79. The bacon, $3.55. The salad, $2.99. That's cheap for those. Uh, vine tomatoes, $2.39. The chicken strips, $3.49. The butter, $2.65. The roast, $4.77. That's not bad. Shredded lettuce, $1.49. Crispy potato circles, $1.99. We got a case of water, $1.69. Uh, the peanut puffs were $1.99. Applesauce cups, cheap, $1.19. For six, that's good. $1.85 for breakfast bowls. The pie, $4.99. And like I said, $0.46 cents for the diced tomatoes. The potato sticks, the German potato sticks were $1.19. Uh, the Senior Rico, uh, Rice puddings, two thirty-eight. Sour creams, eighty-five, eighty-nine for the pinto beans. Barbecue sauce, dollar ninety-nine. Brioche buns, three fifty-nine. Pimento cheese, two ninety-nine. Hawaiian rolls, dollar twenty-nine. And I said ninety-nine on the cookie. The little brioche buns with chocolate, three thirty-five. The mini muffins, two thirty-nine. So we got an Italian mineral water and tried it. It's sparkling mineral water. We both tried it. It's good. And I got two bags of garden soil over there for $2.99. It looks like at least one cubic uh, foot or whatever. Uh, that's really cheap. I really, I really just needed some cheap dirt to fill in some holes. There's a hole here in the back. I don't want anybody to step in or anything. Enjoy runs into it with the mower i don't know how i guess there was roots or something under there that must have i don't know i don't know how that hole got out there 
maybe some roots just finally get you know just deteriorated enough to where there was a hole there I don't know what but it's far away from the, the closest stump so I don't know how it I don't know just things happen like that sometimes and I don't think it's a sinkhole I hope not so I'm gonna put some of that dirt in it and that's outside so I'm not able to show it but it it has um, fertilizer in it it's garden soil it's the last soil that I ha they had there said potting soil on it so I didn't get any of it this one's for gardens so if y'all need any uh, I, I don't know the brand but it's usually all these things are pretty good they they buy pretty good stuff and sell it you know but um, Y'all might want to check out at your Aldi for some of this garden soil. It, I bought two bags of it, and it actually looks pretty good. I may have to use it and see if it on something just to kind of experiment and see how good it is. But anyway, that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed this uh, little Dollar Tree haul and Aldi haul. Please press that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out, and share, please. Share with everyone and press like and share and press like. Right, Kitty? Her eyes water. Her allergies. My allergies are acting up. Her allergies must be. We're gonna take her. Uh, we're gonna take her for a walk. I guess we might film it, but I doubt that I'll upload it today. I've already done enough. So um, if I do, I'll I'll upload it tomorrow or something. But later on, I mean, no, I haven't done enough because later on I am going to do Ask My Tablet, as I talked about earlier. But if I do one with Kitty, I'll just wait till tomorrow. But uh, if you haven't checked it out, check out the first one we did of her out in the stroller the first time she went, and she loved it. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you later on. God bless.